Hello, and welcome to the ICC Configuration Studio tutorials. In this tutorial, I'll give a brief overview of database logic and provide a simple example to convert a temperature value from Celsius to Fahrenheit. Database logic is a powerful yet simple mechanism to perform PLC-style operations on any data stored in the Gateway's internal database. It consists of basic logical, arithmetic, trigonometry, and filtering operations. These operations can be combined to form complex data manipulation functions. Each operation has one or more inputs and one output. Every input to an operation can be either a constant value or a value from a database location. All operations also support scaling the input values and the output value via a multiplier field. Some concepts of database logic extend beyond the scope of this tutorial. For a more detailed discussion of database logic, including many examples of how it can be used, take a look at the resources section on our website. Now that we have a basic understanding of what database logic is, let's put it to use in an example. In this simple configuration, we're using the gateway to read a temperature value from a Modbus device and expose that value on a BACnet network. The temperature on the device is in Celsius, but we want to change this to Fahrenheit for our BACnet network. We can convert Celsius to Fahrenheit by following this equation. Because the equation follows the form of the common linear equation y equals mx plus b, we can perform this conversion using a single add operation by taking advantage of the built-in scaling using the multiplier field. To add database logic to a configuration, we first need to select the device. Then click on internal logic. And then add database logic. Once we've added database logic to our configuration, we can see all the available operations we can perform on our data. For our temperature conversion, we need to use the add operation. You can see that the settings for the operation are grouped by the inputs and the output. For input 1, we want to use the temperature read from our Modbus device, which is stored at database address 0. Because this is a Modbus register, the data type is 16-bit unsigned. Now we can enter the multiplier we wish to scale this database value by before performing the add operation. For input 2, we want to check the use constant value checkbox. We'll enter 32 into the constant value field to add 32 to our other scaled input. Finally, we have to store the result of the operation into the database. We'll use the next available database address, address 2. And again, we'll use a data type of 16-bit unsigned. We'll leave the multiplier at 1 since we don't need to scale the output value before storing it into the database. The last thing we need to do is change our BACnet object mapping to use the new Fahrenheit temperature value. We need to change the database address to 2 to map it to the output of the add operation. We'll also go ahead and change the units to Fahrenheit, and we're done. I hope this tutorial has introduced you to some of the ways you can use database logic. If you'd like to learn more about how to use the ICC Configuration Studio, take a look at the other tutorial videos. Thanks for watching.